Hello there and welcome to Lower 6 Maths A Level paper, Practice Paper A and here we're on question 6. The population P of a bacteria in an experiment could be modelled by the formula P equals 100 e to the 0.4 t where t in t is the time in hours after the experiment began. Use the on model to estimate the population of bacteria 7 hours after the experiment began. Ok, well t here is representing the time we have t as 7 hours, so what I'm just going to do is use my formula and plug in the value of t equals 7. So p equals 100 e to the 0.4 times 7, and doing this completely on my calculator, I'm going to get 1,644 um, bacteria. Okay. Uh, part B is interpret the meaning of the, hun the constant 100 in the model. Okay, so it's looking at this 100 here. Now, any model where we have a number times an exponential to the power of something, the 100, in this case here, is the initial... bacteria population. So if I was to plug in t equals zero, so no time had elapsed before the, before the experiments began, uh, e to the zero will give you one, so 100 times one will give you 100. So you can see there how when you set t equal to zero, you're going to get 100 out, so after no time has elapsed. That's why we get the word initial from before the experiment began. OK, how many whole hours after the experiment began does the population of bacteria first exceed 1 million, according to the model? OK, well, what we're going to want to happen is for our model, e 100e to the 0.4t to be exceeding or be greater than 1 million. And now we've just got to work out what t is from this model here. So we divide through by 100. We've got to be very careful that we deal with our negatives properly when we're doing inequality equations. So this is going to be um, 10,000. And then as both sides are positive, we can carry on. So 0.4t uh, is greater than... So to get rid of e, the opposite the inverse function of e is to learn both sides. So it's learn of 10,000. And then divide through by the 0 0.4 and t needs to be greater than learn of 10,000 over 0 0.4. And this is going to give us an answer of t um, will have to be 24 hours Um, greater than or equal to 24 hours, so really this isn't equal to. So by the time we get to 24 hours, um, the model will have exceeded 1 million um, population of bacteria. You can check your answer by plugging 24 back into your equation. You should get a number that comes out to be more than a million. And if you were to put 23 in, you should get a number that's less than 1 million. Okay, that's great, six marks.